Hello again, my name is Gunnar Schaefer and I'm going to teach you how to um, start your seed. Either spinach, cilantro, lettuce, anything will work. So what we have here are one inch cubes of rock wool. It's heated rock that is spun into this um, wool and it's called uh, rock wool. You can find it at any aquaponics or hydroponics store. So we have 98 in this tray. You can buy them in um, flats of like 100, 98, 20, 200. You can buy different um, types and sizes. So what we did is we, we uh, soaked it in water, just like so. It soaks up really nicely. And we planted each row with two seeds. So we put two seeds in each hole. Then take a little um, dowel rod, a small broken dowel rod, and push it down just like so. Then they will sprout up about half inch to an inch within one week and then we'll um, show you the results of that and um, we'll show you how we select the best seeds. Thanks! So we have two methods that we are trying to germinate seeds. One is in the flat plate as I explained a little bit earlier the second one, uh, we have experimented in growing them in a gutter that we bought at Lowe's or your um, home depot store. And what we did is we lined up 98 of these in one gutter. And it's, it's very good for the window seal. So if you have a long window seal in your house or your, um, or your office or wherever that you're going to be growing these in your system, we planted 98 in here. And as you can see, we put two seeds in each rock wool. So what we want to do is take out the bad, the bad uh, plants. So we want um, there to be uniform growth. So we take out any lettuce um, uh, plants that, that look inferior. So maybe size or um, in some cases there's yellowing. And we want to pluck out the worst. That, that way that the other plants can um, grow a little bit quicker and we only want one lettuce head per rock wool when it's in the completed tower so after about two more weeks and these are a week old we'll be able to transplant these into our aquaponics tower with two inch net cups and it'll go in just like this you'll tear one off and keep it nice and wet you want to keep these wet at all times we are actually using our aquaponics uh, fish water that has bacteria um, and other things in it, so the nutrients, and it fits in just like so, and then it fits really nicely into the tower. That's all. Thank you.